you might not realize that cloud computing creates carbon emissions. When you use the Microsoft Cloud, that usage generates carbon in various ways. For example, when we transport servers, operate data centers, or when one of our manufacturing partners makes the servers in the first place. The Microsoft Emissions Impact Dashboard provides transparency into carbon emissions that Microsoft accrues on your behalf for your cloud infrastructure use. You can use reports generated by the Emissions Impact Dashboard to help calculate your company's carbon impact and report externally to investors and decision makers or to help meet statutory requirements. Because emissions data is based on billing data, the Emissions Impact Dashboard provides access to users with billing admin rights. You can navigate to your Azure or EA portal to validate your permissions. To view the Emissions Impact Dashboard, you must be an Enrollment ID or Billing Account Administrator with right permissions, who is either an EA Direct, MCA, or CSP with Azure Plan and you'll need to have a Power BI Pro license. The Emissions Impact Dashboard takes your billing information and allocates carbon emissions based on what we know about the carbon impact of our data centers. This is your data, and Microsoft doesn't do the carbon impact calculation without your permission, which is why you'll need to connect your billing data after downloading the tool. Let's start by installing the tool from AppSource. Go to AppSource and search for Emissions Impact Dashboard. When prompted, click Install. This could take a little while. You'll see the Emissions Impact Dashboard listed with the rest of your Power BI apps. Click on Go to App or on the app name to get started. With the tool installed, it's time to connect your billing data to the Emissions Impact Dashboard. Look for the banner that says Connect Your Data to Begin Authentication. Provide your enrollment ID or billing account ID. You'll then be prompted through an OAuth step. Select your admin credentials and follow the prompts. Finally, click Connect. Your billing data will take up to 24 hours to populate into the Emissions Impact Dashboard. When you next log in, you'll see carbon emissions information on the dashboard. Our next video will show you how to use that information, what it means, and how to generate and download reports.